Let's do an example using composition of functions for a real life problem. So suppose you receive a $10 off coupon for your favorite store. And when you get to the store, there's a sale going on where everything is 25% off. How should you use your coupon with the discount in order to pay the least amount of money? So we can think of these uh, $2 off amounts as two functions. We'll let the first one, c of x, equals x minus 10. This represents taking $10 off uh, your final amount. So x is the amount you're going to spend. And then we'll define p of x, which is your 25% your off piece. And we would represent that as 1 minus 0.25 times the amount you spend. And that's going to simplify to 0.75x. So you're going to be paying 75% of the amount, which is the same as 25% off. So suppose you buy $100 worth of items. This composition is going to represent taking $10 off the purchase and then 25% off of that. So let's see. So the amount of our purchase is 100. If we take 10% off, that's going to be 90. And then if we take 75% off of the 90, we would spend 67.50. The other choice is we take our 100, we take the 25% off first, which gives us $75, and then we use our coupon to take $10 off of that, leaving us with a bill of $65. So you can see the second choice is best, and that's an example of how you would use composition of functions in a real-life situation.